Yo, what's going on? Stream 995 Phil here, and I am here with Swift Tom Hanks. KNWNVA Swift Tom Hanks. What is going on? You can't really see us, but I'll throw you on over here anyway. It can angle it this way and see us a little bit. There they are. What's up? <laughs> oh, wow. Totally wrong sides, so I would have to change that. But anyway, you guys are not interested in seeing us. You guys are interested in seeing the people over there. There they are. Wow, you can only see one of them. So we'll have to angle that a little bit better later on. I'll uh, get some game sound up here a little more. There we go. I think we can hear that a little better. What is going on, Digi? Good to see you there. Yes, yeah, so anyway, meanwhile, back at Combat Network headquarters, we are officially live, and the tournament is about to get going. So we are in a casual at the moment. Mike Metroid, is that you using uh, Grundy? Okay, so I do have everything on the correct side. I'm glad you guys like the overlays. Thank you, I appreciate it. Project Injustice logo looks nice. Thank you, thank you. Actually, I didn't really do the Project Injustice logo. Oh, well, it looks good. That, that, I, I, I gotta give uh, I gotta give credit uh, where credit is due. That is uh, Kazi from Kazi Graphics. Ah, nice, good. Uh, he took care of that. It looks really good. What's going on, Wawa? Good to see you in the stream. Uh, anyway, so. Uh, we got everybody playing casuals. Yo, man, lots of night night wings today, dude. Tons. That's Tons. Good. I well, like. What a, I thought this was like an unpopular character. I I'm keep I keep reading that he's broken. So he's really good, man. Let's like, hear it. Let's. I want to see it. Really good. I mean, we're bringing two from Philly, and now Luzlo's also one. So Look at that. All right. Okay. It was like the House of Night Wings. Okay. House of Night Wing. Okay. I like it. I'm in. Let's do it. All the characters that, like, you know, I'm expecting to see. I don't know about you, but, like, I mean, like, I'm expecting to see at least, like, the initial people, the people that are freaking out about. People freaking out about, you know, Doomsday. Dermsday. Yeah. Like, Derp's Day. Derp's Day. <laughs> or Derp's Day. Deathstroke. Uh, Who's, you know. uh, basically, Deathstroke is entirely punishable, too. Yeah, I, dude, pe people fuck stupid when they when they complain about Deathstroke. Well, you know what it is? It's, it's, it's a lot of the online people. Well, he's, pro he's probably much better online he's much than he is offline. He's much safer online, online. Yeah, of course. Sure. Of course. Uh, but even then, you know, I, when I, you know, when we're, we're coming here, when we were practicing uh, the other night, we're like, all right, we got to get ready for Doomsday and all this other stuff, and he, Doomsday and Deathstroke didn't show up. Oh, Instead, Nightwing yeah. showed up. Okay, Nightwing is in the house. All right, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to actually kind of hand this off to you for one second, because one of my close friends, Cal Dragon, who is here behind you, um, he's going to be leaving momentarily, okay. and so I'm going to go say goodbye to him. Okay. So I'm going to drop this. Names yeah, you, I know you're good at this stuff, so I'm going to let you handle it for a few minutes, and we'll bring on Hinoshora. Come on over and come do my, some stream commentary for a little while. He's going to come say hi to you guys for a while. I'm going to say goodbye to my buddy here. Here is Swift Tom Hanks. He's going to help you guys out. We also have uh, Troy here. He's going to be with you guys today, and uh, we're going to have a good time. Uh, this is not tournament. This is casuals. We're going to have ca tournament matches soon. Uh, we're going to get through these brackets. We've got about 30-plus players. We're going to have a good time tonight. Hello. Hello. What up? Right. How's it going? Good, good. Uh, bop it up and up. Keep talking while I do this. So, wow. You know, I'm watching Mike Metroid's uh, Grundy. 
He's uh he's got a pretty good Grundy. But what I don't understand is I mean like I know uh, Nightwing's rushed on and all, but he has a lot of good zoning elements. He has a lot of good zoning elements. I don't understand why uh oh there we go, finally. Alright. There you go. And right. Luzlo wins. Alright. The uh the tournament's already started, by the way. Uh this is just a casual match just so we can oh, get okay. up and running. Right I thought they were away. playing tournaments, I didn't say anything. I was watching Luzlo just um just uh fighting against Grundy and he kept rushing him down and eating the armor specials, right? But he's like not zoning him with the staff, because like that stuff is like plus nine on block and like plus eighteen if he EX, but now he's starting to do that, so which is good. Wait, wait, wait. The I don't the normal staff is not plus nine on block. The lightning. Yeah, the EX one is. The, uh, no, the what's your friend? I forgot what his name was. He told me the EX is plus eighteen. Oh, I don't think the normal one's plus. He told me the normal one's plus. That would be an infinite then. Pretty sure the EX is plus. I don't know. I don't know. I'm just taking whatever. whatever if his I word see is. a normal one, I jump afterwards. Yeah, that's what I do. If EX, no jumping. Yeah. I could be wrong. So I had to like jump uh, all that zoning and stuff with Nightwing. He gives that stroke kind of. Pro he gives that stroke problems. Nightwing's good, man. Nightwing's very good. But yeah, all right. So we oh, got the Grundy. Nice Grundy cool. grab. Oh, oh, oh. Nightwing's got a lot of ooh. derpy elements to him, though. Like that flying grazing right there, it's too good. Yeah. Like, well, I mean, I don't, I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. Don't don't take me that I'm like complaining for nerfs, but like. No, we're not complaining for nerfs. It's, we, just, it's good. We just have to get around I'm just, it. I'm just pitching. I know. But uh, it's it's like a why not kind of move. You know what I mean? Like yeah. Uh, like it's uh similar to like Sonya's you know R kick, right? But it's it it says it's negative three in the frame data, but we tested it and they duck at the same time. I think it's really zero. Yeah. Which is good, man. Fucking flying across the screen, zero frames. That's a frame trap right there. Yeah. Mike Metroid respected it though. Again, oh man, Bond is both interactables. Yeah, man. Some of these interactables, man, are like so big and hard to dodge. Yeah, some of them are free. Like I was playing Brady before, and uh, you know we're playing whatever, going back and forth, and then he starts beating me a large number of the games. Two of them, straight up, just throwing interactables, getting hit by that pig, pig, pig. I'm like, pig. oh, I'm gonna throw it. No, sorry. Pig Ring. is really good. Yeah, pig uh, is really good. The ones that don't go away, like Pig, like Dumpster. Dumpster. You're not a strength character. Yeah. At least strength characters ba break Dumpster. Yeah. No, no one breaks Pig. You're not gonna see him with too much Deathstroke action. I think Hito might be the only Deathstroke here. Yeah, uh, I think people realize that he's he's good, but like his zoning isn't that good. Like it's good, but I mean he's got really good zoning. It's just oh, it is they really good. They no, eventually just get good. in. They eventually get yeah, in, and, and then he, he has and problems. Then he has no, yeah, exactly. But he should. So, yeah. Uh, Second or third best owner in the game. Well, I think we only have two testers here. Who are here. Yeah, I'm they're glad. I'm playing. actually glad the testers uh, Let are them playing. Play. No, I'm glad they're playing yeah. because you know they're sharing stuff that they know. Whatever, yeah. And we're learning from it. Unlike people who complain about testers and then they download the game and they play in a tournament. Like, who who would that be? I'm not saying anything. Okay. All right. Yeah, Tom Brady's here. Rio's yeah, here. Yeah, Tom Brady, Rio. Uh, That's it for testers. That, Oh, we're talking about testers. All right, yeah. I thought they were just naming people. We got Long Island Joe. He's kind of you cold, bro. You cold? Yeah, Joe's cold. <laughs> cool. We got Rap right over here, best Batman right now. Him and Rio. Well, Rio's better, but you're really good too. So you're second best Batman. So pound oh, yeah. it. Uh. Yo, Aquaman. Yo, doesn't Jay Bustin look like um? There we go. Commentator Cam. Who am I? Who am I? Watch, watch this. Who am I? Um, uh, anybody who wears headphones? No, no. Take note where they are. Let me guess. I see a lot of people do that, but in the fighting game community, is he, are you Chris G? All right. I'm Chris G. A lot of people do that though on the head. That's stupid. No, actually, if you think about it, certain people, they, like... Why do you I, wear your earphones above your ears? No, just to, like, to chill if you don't want to listen to music. Because some people, you know how they put it around Take the neck? Certain headphones around the neck, they can, like, oh, choke you and everything, you know? So... 
But like some people will find it more comfortable like that than around the neck. So, but that was a button check. Dave Bustin versus Tom Brady. Tom Brady has a really good Green Lantern too. Like his Aquaman, whoo! His Aquaman's ridiculous. His Aquaman? Tom Brady's. Yeah, it is good. Yeah, you got a pretty good Aquaman too. Thanks. One day the throne will be mine. Yeah. All you have to do is just kill him. I could call. I could call this war now between Brady and I, Game of Thrones. <laughs> Digi, what's up, man? How you been? All right, let's see this. All right, oh, Brady gets a starting hit. Three. Ooh, got some trident combos. EX uh, stat, whatever the hell that's called. All right, wow. All right, 41%. Oh Look Keep at that pressure. pressure. On. Oh, Batman gets out of it. Yep. Glides Uses over. the interactable. Oh, anti tired though. Jumps in, gets, gets a free He's combo. Got a block low. Oh. Did not connect overhead. that combo, though. Oh, he overheaded into the, uh, the throne bounce. Oh. Oh, punishes there that. Go. Oh, nice, nice dash in. Combo. Ooh, done, 30%. And Aquaman is not useless after all. Aquaman's so good in this game, man. Ooh, 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 ooh. Oh, nice, man. Ooh. Keeps him away from that corner. Oh, throws ooh, back into the corner, love though. it. Doesn't go for the tablet. Going in for poke pressure. Jeez, man. Ooh, ooh. Oh, flips him out. Throws him back. Damn. That's a lot of damage. I hope Dave Buster knows it's push block. Or uh, wager. When I see people die without using wager, at least, one, I mean, well, you know, using it, period. I mean, there's no reason not to use it. I only use it either A, if I have more meter than my opponent, obviously. Even look, man, if you're going to die, or use it. Or B, if I'm in the corner and I'm, like, losing life, I'll do it just to make everything yeah, mid-screen again and I can start zoning, so. But you got to use it before you die. Yeah. You're stupid if you don't. Ooh. Ooh. Bad oh, anti air. Two bad anti airs. This Batman not using too many bats. Empty damage here. See what he does after this. There's so many options that Aquaman has after he ends a combo. And he. Oh, jumps in. Empty jump in. Uh, yeah, Dave can pull out those bats. Get those bats going on. Finally. Oh. Doesn't use the bats for the combo. Use them for pressure here. Uh. Brady will back ones out. Brady just dashing in. I mean, you can punish ooh. that. Ooh, ooh. All right, here we go. Here Full we go. combo. Yep. Easy 43% right here. 40. Oh, scoop. That's the one thing. No one punishes Scoop. Scoop's punishable. You know what it is? There we go. Here's a wager. He'll get some help right. back from this. Um, I think what the reason is is like people are so scared of Aquaman's pressure because it's just high, low, high, low, high, low, high, low. They just don't know what to do. They just panic upon pressure. So how punishable is it though? Like combo punishable or just like how punishable is what? Scoop? Yeah. Uh, it's pretty punishable. Like, how many frames? Uh, high, high teens. Wow, all right. All right, so Brady takes that 2-0. Well, it's done. That was 2-0. Oh, oh Yeah, that's how quick it went. Oops. Ares has that unblockable reset, but you can get out of it. It's not guaranteed. It's a legit reset. It does so much damage, though. It's crazy. That's all right. It's a handle. You have to have... Yes. 
CD Jr. is not here. He did not want to show up. CD Jr., CD, or Max did not show up today. I don't know if they, they wanted to show up or not, but they're not here, which is weird. But what are you going to do? None of the Dominicans are here. Yeah, man. What the hell? Weird, right? I was told that they uh, were going to be here. Junior is having... He's trying to find a main. He's having like a character crisis right now. He doesn't know who to play. I don't think that's why they didn't show up. I know that's not why they didn't show up. Maybe they had something to do today. I think Maxter said he had like a, a final or something like that. Probably. He's normally their, their Driver. ride. So. What happened to Ryu? Does he play this game? I don't know. That's weird. Him and J360. I know J J360 hasn't even bought the game yet. Yeah, he's waiting for the meta game to develop before he buys the game. He wants really? to see how competitive play is. Wow. Yeah, before he plays it. So, which is smart. I mean, what I would scumbag. I would have not bought the game, but I got it for free. So, yeah, I won that tournament. That'll so. do it. Yeah. Do we have an opponent? Do it. Do it. Anybody, man. All right, next match. All right, we'll give you. Uh. All right, casual play right now, I guess. Yeah, I'm loving this comic book theme. It's so cool. <laughs> uh, I'm sorry, guy at the end. What's your name? No, the other guy. Oh, that's Jailhouse. 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 Jailhouse is Green Lantern, man. That turbine, man. This guy. Hey, Digi, why aren't you here right now? Green Lantern. Harley Quinn. Oh. Thank you. Yeah, yeah. Got it. Oh, Lozla? Oh, it's a match. Let them get like two casual games in and then we'll go. Alright, play. Play, play, come casual. Yeah. Just to keep things interesting. Alright, this is casuals. Yeah, there'll be one or two of these and then we're gonna get Jailhouse versus Lozlo. Wait, what didn't. Uh, this font doesn't have a lowercase, it just makes it smaller. Yeah. So. Check out his Green Lantern, it's freaking. It's good? Yeah. He's got some crazy, like, tech with Turbine. I want to say tech, but, like, what he does is, like, on knockdown, after the combo, he'll jump very quickly and do Turbine over your body and then get, like, a reset, ah, yes. which is really crazy. I was like, wow. Yeah, Lantern's pretty legit, man. He is. Yeah, I mean, there's a lot of opportunities uh, for him after he... Uh, oh. Watch that right there. Bam. Oh. But he dropped that the combo, cool. though. Yeah, he dropped the combo, though. Yeah, yeah. Wait, so Turbine's supposed to hit you? No, he just does it to dash over you because yeah, it's so safe it on recovery, and he'll go with a low or something. Ah. Yeah, it's a nice, uh, nice I little like uh, reset. I wonder if, if you knew that's coming, though, if you could wake, reverse all your wake-ups. I'm fucking pop. Yeah, see, pa uh, Paco's right. That lantern, man. Harley apparently is really good in this game. Once a Green Lantern, always a Green Lantern. Ooh, okay, here we go. Look at that, see? Either overhead or low. Yeah, I like it. I haven't seen that before. A lot of lanterns seem to end in lift, and then they go Bam. with like a Picks four or three or yeah. a down or back one. This is good. It's original. Yeah, those barrels—they don't go very far. Yeah, Jailhouse is a force to be reckoned with. He was—he won Skullgirls at uh, ECT last year. Oh, he was right. really good at Marvel. This guy's legit, though. This guy's legit. Yeah. He picks up games so quick. This kid. I'm like the exact opposite. It takes me a while to pick up games and stuff. So. Very cool. Green Lantern. No, I'm not. I'm not. 
dishing Green Lantern players. Uh, I think he's an easier character to pick up, like, to start learning this game with. That's fine. I mean, like, there but are easy characters to help you. Just yeah. because they're easy to pick up with doesn't mean they're easy to win with. Exactly. Like, you still have to have the skill to, to take over. Yeah, yeah, like, Deathstroke's easy to pick up, but you can learn the mechanics of the game with them. Same thing exactly. with Green Lantern. And stuff. So, yeah, so, I mean, this, this is a perfect character for someone like Joe House who, I mean, doesn't, you know, it sounds like he doesn't have, like, the MK background yeah. for, like, the combos and whatnot. Wow. Wow, really good, man. Oh, my yeah. God. So whoever's going up against Jailhouse in the tournament is going to have a... Oh my we'll God, get one gonna more, gonna and we're going to get Luz Low on really stream, all right? We'll get one more, and then put Luz Low on stream for a tournament. All right, so one more game Jesus, with these guys. Luz Low is going to have a pretty rough time against Jailhouse. Ooh, unblockables. Arturo is not here, no. Long Island Joe is here, though, which is good. Yeah, and so sweet Johnny Cage. ECT showed up. Yep, ECT showed up, man. We got like 40-ish. Yeah, around there. <laughs> I'm a, uh, I don't know. Nah, never. What's up? I thought that was your... Oh, no, no, no. I was, I was going to say, I'm, I'm kind of glad that we uh, niched the MK9 tournament here and we're just doing Injustice. Yeah, because I feel bad for Tetris Spirit because he does not like this game and he came from Philly to play MK9. Yeah. And now he's not doing anything. He's just sitting there. Well, well he needs to enter Injustice and level up. He doesn't like it. He's like, I don't like this game. I don't like... He told me he doesn't like the fact that everyone has broken stuff because it's not fair. And he thinks that the game MK9 was like ba more balanced. It was balanced better. And I was oh, like... Oh, uh, please. I don't know, like. Look, man. If I every... told them, I'm like games that have uh, games, fighting games that have great tools for every character, just so they can handle top tier, and anyone can do well, makes it a balanced game, and it makes it fun too. If everybody has broken stuff, then nothing is broken. So I don't understand that logic. Look, man, I'm just gonna say it as it is. The people who are really hating on this game, it's not that like they don't. It's, I mean, they might not like it, but it's really just because they suck at it. I mean. I'm gonna have to no. agree. Like, I don't mean to call anybody out, but there's a certain someone. Like, I love, I love this kid. He's a great guy. Good friends with him. But he doesn't like the game because of the ambiguous cross-ups. Whatever. Get used to it. Get used to it. He, he thinks that uh, it adds a whole level of depth. This game's amazing. He doesn't like the ambiguous cross-ups. He doesn't like the fact that zoning's so powerful. But he used a top-tier character in MK9. You know what I'm saying? And I'm like, why are you complaining? I don't get it. I I don't know, man. Like. If there's just more depth to this game than almost any other fighter. I'm, I'm li I like it. I like watching it too, and like there's a lot of fighters out there that aren't fun to watch, and this one is. So, well, anyway, now we're gonna get a tournament match, so now we'll do some right. legit commentary on tournament match. Good. Once a Green Lantern, always a Green Lantern. Games, uh, honestly, games, uh, game is this game's a lot of fun. Um. Like I said, I can't really say who's broken, who's not broken at the moment. Because, like, right now, people are saying, you know, Doomsday is, like, overpowered. Um, we're finding stuff to counter his rushdown. It ends up working very well. Um, people found stuff to counter Deathstroke zoning to get in. Because, you know, just takes time to develop. There's no need for patches right away, which I'm happy about. I'm happy NRS is just letting it, let it, let it, let it set, settle down. Wait for the game to marinate a little bit and see what happens. So... Um, yeah, no, exactly. You don't want to make any knee-jerk reactions. So. Yeah. Um, all right, so yeah, Luzlo is one of the many Nightwings that we'll be seeing tonight. Yep. There's a, lot. There's a lot of Nightwings. And no, Morty is... Not Morty. Uh, yeah, Morty. Uh, Warda is not here. Yeah, I think he was asking if, if Warda was the one that you were talking about. He doesn't like the game, and yada, yada, yada. No, 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 no. He's asking, is Warda getting into this game? Uh, Warda's still playing uh, Marvel right now, no, I think. But I think Keto might be talking about Eric Warda. Oh, no, 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 Morty, I'm not talking about Warda. All right, here we go. Um, back to the game. I'll tell you on Facebook, don't worry about it. But yeah, back to the game. And sup, bro. How you doing, good? All right, here we go. Nice. Gets the first oh, hit. Yeah. Gets Wing that meter. Is a good start, man. Oh, throws that TV. Dashes, Dashes in. in, man. Is Luzlo going to look for that other TV? No, he just walks in. 
Nice, nice. Really? Oh, oh misses, misses it. the, the flying Grayson. Grayson can't do it from full screen. He doesn't oh, jump up for the plant or anything. Oh, oh, no, never mind. Wingdings is a strong character. I'm not used to weaker characters. Ooh, ooh. That staff, man, there's so much advantage on block. Oh, yeah. Well, good pushback, though, man. Because, or push block. I mean, that's, that, yeah. You want to push block something that's like advantage on block. I know you're spending meter too, but I mean, ooh. it is what it is. All right, let's see his corner game. I mean, Nightwing's staff has some really nuts corner that game. That is so plus some block, you can just keep doing it. Like, Kenshi's Oh, up. I know, yeah. man. Down one into that staff tour. I'm not sure what it's actually called, but EX yeah. on that is plus Down. some block. Oh, he could have converted that, I think, in the corner. He, he dropped it, unfortunately. Yeah. Ooh. Nice flying grace. Flying grace, another crazy move by Nightwing. That's really good. Good push block. Get out ooh, of there. Ooh, yeah, nice. Ooh. Good. All right, ooh, let's ooh. see how he'll end here. Ooh. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, the ambiguous cross-ups. Wow. Go Jailhouse setup, man, that's, and that's throws absurd, the plan. Yo, oh, ooh. Uh, take notes on that. Jesus. Oh, does has oh, got a great rush that. down though right now. Yeah, I know, but Jailhouse is gonna have to keep doing this, man. He does not. Oh, know. nice, nice. Pushing him away, going back to zoning. Ooh, ex at. Oh Plus man, man, full free, full screen train traps. Yo, TV, and gets hit by gotta the TV. Gotta make use of those interactables. Oh. Catches ooh, him with ooh. the chain gun. Oh, another ooh. chain gun. One more and it's over. Uh, Oh, oh, right in the chest. Jeez. Right in the chest. That was a good match. That was nuts, man. That was a, actually a legit, I, I would call that a comeback. Green Lantern. It was uh, a nice uh, nice comeback was like from, uh, I mean, He was getting Jailhouse. bullied in the corner. It got himself out and won the match, man. Yes. It's one nothing Jailhouse right now. Let's see if uh, Luzlo can make a comeback right now. Begin. Gets him with the setup again with a TV. Gets that Gatling gun going. Tons of good, good chip, good time to Another use that with the trade for the extra range. We're uh. gonna see if J Jailhouse probably wants to avoid this corner. I mean, because that's where you know where he started to lose. Wow, catches the flying Grayson. Oh, and nice lift. read, man. Nice read. You cannot jump yes. on Green Lantern at all. Free combos. Gotta all watch day. out for that uh, stage interactable right behind them there too. That they're kind of working at. He has the advantage. Oh, oh, now he can use it. At the uh, get him, get him. Oh, gets hit right in the face. I don't know, man. I always eye up those stage interactables right now. Like, if I was Jailhouse, I'd be looking at that pipe. Ah, oh, there we go. There you go. Ah. Now he's zoning him. He's oh, got he the goes in. I don't know if I'd go in, man. I mean, like, Jailhouse is, is in, in control at full screen. Uh, like, in air, and he does a turn by, and he gets severely punished. I'd wait for a knockdown to do that, you know? Oh, and wagers. Nice. All right. Yeah, good wager. You always want to use... I mean, like, like I said before, if you die with wager, you're doing it wrong. All right, um, I'm going to answer Digimon's question right after this fight. All right, boom, boom. Gets that pressure going. Ooh, 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 ooh. All right. Keep him in the corner. Oh, good. Another, yo, he uses the push block really well. Yes. You said he came from Marvel, right? What? You said you said he came from Marvel? He came from Skullgirls. Skullgirls. Okay. Skullgirls. He played Marvel for a bit, but we didn't get into okay. the game. Then he went to Skullgirls. All right. After this transition, we go, we got Pig coming up, man. Ooh. Here it is. Pig, pick it up. Oi, 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 throw it! Oi! Oi, oi! Ah! Oh, man. All right, 2 0, Jailhouse. Good performance by Luzlo. Great that. performance by uh, Jailhouse. And to answer Digi's question, yes, I want to, if they make an MK10, I want to see all the returning characters. But a lot of them need to be good. <laughs> I want to see Noob better. That's all I got to say. I want a better Noob. What's up? What's up? I'm trying to squeeze through. What's up? No. Come to me. You mind if I come to me? Why don't I come to Snoop Tom Hanks, man? You don't want to come to me? I never come to Snoop Tom Hanks. Fine, fine, fine. Damn. Damn. You're my old BSM commentating partner, man. Just one match. One match with good uh, old Swift Tom Hanks. Okay. Man. So you entered this tournament under a different name. <laughs> no, no, I didn't. I don't know what you're talking about. I I, I heard that, the, that there's a different there's a different member, different guy in this tournament. Uh, under the name. The, no, no, no. It'll, <laughs> let's drop that. What what is the name? I don't know. I forget. <laughs> Apparently, well, someone who looks a lot about? like. Swift Tom Hanks joined under the name he does of look a lot like GGA me. Bracket Rigger. That's what he joined as. Swift Tom Hanks has joined the tournament as GGA Bracket Rigger.
All right, sorry. I'm back now. All right, we need a stream match here, guys. All right. Yo, these, these guys running the tournaments. They got to get us some matches. Uh, who we got coming up here? The brackets got... What happened? The bracket, the program got messed up? or? Uh, yeah, I think so. I think they didn't save it, and I think they closed it. I think. I think. Uh, I don't know. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I don't think we've seen high level anything in tournament yet, man. I so you're saying that you're not a high level player? I, mean, I wouldn't classify me as a high level player. No, I think we all have a lot to learn, man. And myself especially. You heard it. You heard it here fo first, folks. Tom Brady, scrub. Uh, I would definitely say I am. Um, you're okay. I'm okay right all now. Right. But, I mean, we're all learning. I mean, so. So, you know, I just found out that this guy, Crimson Shadow, who I've blown up several times, he actually bought me a pizza. At the um, Now I feel terrible. Where did he buy you pizza from? At an Omni Edge 2 tournament. Oh. So here's wait, what I'm willing wait, wait, to do. You went to one of the On the Edges? No, he bought me one from home. So I'm willing to bury the hatchet by allowing him to buy me another pizza. <laughs> wait, what is this? I'll be friendly with you if you buy me shit? Allow Hold on. I will admit Thomas. I got a okay. I will admit I got a little over the top on Crimson Shadow. But he has to buy me a pizza and admit his ranking system is stupid. <laughs> okay. Well, it is stupid. But not, not, he didn't have to say stupid. I just, I just want someone to say, yes, Tom. When somebody can stay retired and not play for five months and go up five, six places, that's a little ridiculous. I understand it works in your system. I just want you to acknowledge that it's just for but fun. But he almost must buy you another pizza. Uh, yeah, no, for sure. What uh, toppings? Pepperoni. All right. I mean, I, I, I totally apologize for running him into the ground. I guess the guy's pretty cool after all. But that, I mean, he, uh, he lives right here. Why isn't he showing up? I don't know. I already lives in Jersey. But I mean, uh, what? This is a match. Okay. AJ, you player two? Wonder if she's Aquaman? I don't know. Guess is better than mine. That's the word on the street, anyway. I can't post any Aquaman information on Test Your Might because. Yo, all right. We got good another good Batman player coming up right here. Rapzilla's got a pretty yeah, sick Batman. and man. Shock, I believe, plays Lex Luthor. Yo, you don't see too many of him, man. Coming no. from the demo, normally no. demo characters like at least in MK, you know, they were pretty popular uh, yeah. at least at the beginning. Uh, but man, no Lex love. Do you like Lex? Do you think he's fun? Uh, to play? I think I think he's good. Well, not even not good. I'm just saying fun to play. Yeah, I think he is. Okay. Uh, I think he's fun to play. I thought sure. he was, like, a little rough, like, in terms of, like, getting getting to understand the game. Like, starting with Lex, he didn't seem like a, a very welcoming character. Yeah. All right, man. Here we go. Are they in matches? This is button check. This is a uh, button, button check. check. I think me allowing Crimson Shadow to buy me another pizza was a great apology, first of all. I mean, here's why I don't like... That's you pretty want, fucked up. So you, if I ever piss you off, you're going to be like, buy me a fucking pizza. All right, I'll admit it right now. Do you want to know... I'll, I'll, I'll confess the real reason why I don't like the ranking system. Do you want to know why the real reason why I don't? Yeah. Because it turns the community upside down. People get so obsessed now with their quote-unquote ranking in some system. They go to tournaments. They want favorable brackets because they're worried about, I can't get, I, I can't get seventh. I got to get fifth because then I'm going to go down. And then my spot is a top. So it makes tournament... All the bracket rigging talk and all that stuff came because people got obsessed with their spots on some ridiculous ranking system, which is why I don't like it. It's no good. But this, this is a number-based community, man. So, I mean, it is what it is. Yeah, I mean, I don't know. You know, honestly, the best kind of ranking systems, in my opinion, I don't know what you think about this, is just do seasons. You know how, like, Evo does a season, and they do, se like, seeding at Evo based on the season, and then after the season's over, you wash it, just like football, man. Look, the bottom line like, is there is no way to do a definite 1 through 20 uh, in order. No, there's You know there's who the not. top players are, and who the, 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 the order is determined the day of a tournament, period. That's the order. All right, here we go. All right, so Lex Yo, Luthor versus Batman. This round is cluttered with shit, like wall to wall. Now hold on, stuff. you can actually—I don't know if Lex Luthor can do it—but when you get to that corner, you can actually duck the interactable 
Uh, um, the, uh, the log? Yes, the, log the, track? the uh, yeah. turbine engine, yes. Uh, now, if a power character Yo, does it... Oh, look at that! Oh, man. Are we going to get a uh, canister here? No, uh, Rex doesn't go for it. Throws out the turret instead. You know oh, he's got Abdilla the missiles there. Rex and Chilling in the corner here. Not using the missiles. Oh, jeez. Yeah, one, one, two. It's not advantage are, anymore. Oh. Yeah, too many hits by Batman there. What Rapzilla, what, what Shock wants to do is he wants to knock him down, and he wants to throw the get uh, that armor on, right? No, for, to throw the trap behind Batman to make sure Batman can't back down. Ah, all right. There we go. Throw the interaction. Oh, I don't know. He does kinda not. Waste, kinda wasted those bats. Yeah, yeah man. Throw that craftsman. Wow, no hit confirmed. Get on your the tool end. game on. Oh, oh, he just throws it out. Now, yeah, throw that. Oh, yeah. I'm hurts. a big fan of interactables, man. Use them. Shock waste oh. that meter there. Uh, yeah. I don't like that from far away. It's only closed. No, that's that's like a trap setup kind of Oh, thing. axe. Totally whiffs. Down one, down one. Jumping axe, down one. Oh, goes to the parry. Oh, oh Shock with the knock pipe. him out oh, the could have been it. And Rapzilla. Oh, man. Shock taking the uh, the wager to the to the grave. I don't get that, man. People aren't wagering. Yeah. They are not wagering. I just want to say to Paulo Garcia in the stream, I want to give a shout out to everyone over at NetherRealm. And I want to say that I think that Ares needs to keep his reset, and uh, I hope it doesn't go. Nice. Throws that shed. Getting some pressure with the bats. Yeah. Going in, gets that jump over two. Jumping two. Oh, geez. Extending that combo. Wow, gets a new one. Okay, I gotta go. Wow, he is all over. Wow, AJ, Rapzilla is all over now. Shock here. All over Shock. Shock is in, shock in trouble right now. Uh, meter burn rockets. Uh, uh, Orbital strike does not connect there. And. Oh, no, Paulo, don't tell me that. And, oh, misses the uh, grappling hook. Shock needs a miracle here. And Rapzilla advances. So the, the Ares reset. Oh, come on, man. You can't take that reset. I, I think they're all good, man. I, I honestly do believe Ares needs his reset. I, 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 he needs that reset. I, I don't want to see him lose that reset. I hope he doesn't lose that reset. So how you doing, Mr. Brady? I'm doing all right. How about yourself? I'm I'm doing okay. I'm in a little bit of a crisis. I I, I don't. Oh, yes, it is fine. Thank you. What is your crisis? Though? My my crisis happens to revolve around the 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 lovable and affable Shazam. See, I'm a I'm a turtle player at heart. I'm defensive. I, I come from the the Tom Brady school of patience, and I feel like to to succeed as Shazam, you have to give no Fs. I don't know if there's a PG. I mean, uh, I don't give any Fs with any cat guy play. Really. Well, I mean, no, most people would brand you as like a very patient, methodical player. Shazam is like beat your, you know, pedal to the metal, YOLO. Why well, would I change two things? I would change. I would change uh, the block infinite of Green Arrow in the corner. I would remove that. And I would change Cyborg's instant air fireball. That's it. I don't. I don't like that block infinite in the corner of Green Arrow. See, I actually like Cyborg's um, block infinite because it makes MK players feel right at home, like that cabal feel. It, it eases the transition, I think. Um, Aquaman, I don't really do anything with Aquaman that needs to be nerfed. I'm, I'm over here fighting like everybody else. I don't really think Aquaman needs anything to, to be nerfed, to be honest with you. He's unsafe, um, so I don't see why, why we'd nerf him. He's plenty unsafe. Yeah, Trident Scoop is like minus 21 or 22 or no, something like that? No, Trident Scoop is minus 13. 15, okay. The minus 21 is the regular ground Trident. Oh, okay. I just uppercut. 
I didn't get sub nerfed. You guys got sub nerfed. I didn't get them nerfed. I mean, that Wonder Woman, they're all good, man. They're all, they're all good. Wonder Woman's... I mean, they're all good. There's no such thing... Wonder Woman's parry is so good. Yeah. Her whole character in Lasso Stance is excellent. Her, her foundational tools are unbelievable. She's got a vicious corner game, ranged overheads, high damage, over 40% meterless combos. There aren't that many characters in the game who can still do that. Over 40% meterless. So uh, excellent, ambiguous um, air dash mix-ups. And she has a stance, uh, a really low down three, great for sweeping and um, setting up those mix-ups. The only thing that's sort of like iffy on her is her projectile. It's minus on hit, so it's like, eh. But she's so good other than that. Wonder Woman's a fantastic character. Okay, here we go. I said I was going to base my decision to do a living guide based on... Uh, so if anybody, if you guys really want me to do a living guide, type one. Can I type one real quick? If you guys actually want me to do a living guide's a lot of work. You guys want to do me to do a living guide? That guy pressed one like 15 times. Does that count for like 15 votes? I mean, this it seems pretty conclusive here. I think people really appreciated the MK living guide. Um, it helped out a lot of people. It's a great resource. Like for example, right now, if you got blown up by something and all the stations were taken and you needed to figure out some frame data or something, you could crack open your living guide and you could you could figure out the matchup a little bit, or at least like some strings that are giving you trouble. It's true. Uh, this living guide will be a thousand times better than the MK living guide. That I can promise you. Paco says don't do a living guide. <laughs> Hollow man. <laughs> man. Instead do replays. Uh, most likely Morty. All right, so what do we have here? It looks like Krispy Kreme and I think DM Brandon, so I'll get those names in. Hey, I think. we need the names on this stream here. We don't know who these guys are. Who are these guys fighting playing right now? What is this match? DM Brandon and Krispy Kreme. All right, DM Brandon here is using Harley Quinn. Uh, that's a good idea, Paula. All right, so here we have uh, Brandon is playing uh, Harley Quinn here, and in big trouble here in the corner. Nightwing's frame traps are absolutely big. Yeah, plus He's got nine meter. on ground burst. He needs to push block immediately. Yeah. You can't put up with that in the corner. Yeah, exactly. He waited a long time to put. Oh wow! Gets and hit of that. Flying Grayson stuffs her right back into the corner. Yeah, Nightwing is very good. Krispy Kreme's Nightwing player is absolutely fantastic right now. He's maintaining the corner pressure. Great use of this tap twirl on wake up. It's very good. Uh, we need to get these names fixed. All right, hold on. Uh. John Edwards. What's going on, John? I don't think I owe Kim this guy. Dude, staff is so good. Come on, Prospect. You didn't like my you didn't like my character guides on the Prima Guide Prospect? I think they were alright actually. Okay, so back three, jumping two. Does not go with the command grab. Wow, goes for a setup there. Doesn't land it. Shows over. Oh, sets the bomb. Oh, blows him up. Nice air gun. Oh, totally whiffs. Probably could have done a much better punish there. Oh, very nice. Uses the air gun to avoid the uh, second part of the staff. 
Got a mount something here. Oh, a launcher. Doesn't convert the combo, though. That's uh, a major advantage. Oh, wow. Puts a oh, very nice air gun there. Oh, drops the combo there. He is not an... Oh. He's got plenty of meter to push block. Wow, again, no punish. Oh, he's got, he's got a push block. He's got a push block. He's got to get out of this. Oh, it's over. Wow. Tremendous block pressure there. So, so DM Brandon advances. Wow. Yeah, I mean, you got to press block. For the Prima God, I did Green Lantern, Sinestro, Shazam. Uh, yeah, that'd be it. That is correct. That is who I did. I mean, I'm actually doing an update uh, to that stuff on TYM. Yes, correct. Tom Lulz Brady. Tom Lulz Brady. Tom Lulz. Um, no, Morty, the reason why I don't post anything in the Alchemist forum is because I don't want to get into that nonsense with the whole sub-zero thing uh like it was back with whatever um you know i wonder chef is i guess an aquaman control freak so i'll just let him run those aquaman forums you guys can get top top tier strats from wonder chef Yeah, uh, I mean, I just, I don't want arguments in those forms, man. Uh, I mean, I guess some mid hits missing. Uh, I haven't seen the Lobo footage yet. I don't know if I'm going to have it for 360 Morty. I don't know that I care enough to have it on both systems. I mean, why would I do that? That's right, John. That's why I play so many different characters. I got footage of me playing Superman. I got footage of me playing uh, whole bunch of Green Lantern. I am not going to Toyukin. <laughs> John. And what is going on, Tom Brady? How are you? What's up, Phil? Doing all right? The Flash. Ah, it's totally turned around, but say what's up to everybody. What's going on, guys at home? All right, so... Uh, Just angle that towards us a little bit more. What? Yeah, angle it towards us a little bit more. There you go. That's good. All right, so what we got coming up here? 
So we got the Ghost of Injust Kaz versus Dr. Handsome. Guys, who's on what side? So Claude Von Stroke, I believe it. Ah, uh, okay. So Claude Von Stroke. That would be the Ghost of Injust Cast. Okay, I'm good with that. Oh, I just want to say this. Did you, did you remind me? There are, I mean, good games, did you? Yeah. But there are some people who are talking about beating me online and ranked or whatever, or the other day. I was doing the daily challenge trying to get 20 supers with Aquaman. <laughs> so they were like, this guy Tom is garbage. He doesn't do any combos. He just sits on his meter. And does supers. Well, I was trying to get the, the experience, man. What does it do for you? Uh, I get experience points. Right, what, I, do, what do the experience do for you? What does it do? Uh, you, you get your level up, man, and you get you know, a little more profile cards, man, for, for online. And I was getting blown up by somebody who beat Just me. Just so you guys know, because you actually can't hear me re respond by staring and blinking at Bill. But oh. that's what I was. I was actually blinking at him. Just like, what? <laughs> I'm, I'm an online warrior. It's true. All right, so here we go. We're in. We got Flash being used by Dr. Handsome here. There's a nice wake-up attack at six frames. Claude Von Stroke going to go for the reset. 1-1-2 one, one, into daggers. Overhead gets blocked. It, it should be forward 1-1. One, one. Forward 1-1. One, one. Well, 1-1-2, one, one, apparently, one, forward 1-1-3 one, one, does not hit everybody, which is why he goes for forward 1-1-2. One, one, Learn something new every day. Overhead into slide and a wager. I don't think it. Shouldn't wager anything right here. Yeah, no. Nah, if, if you're uh, Claude, you don't wager anything. No reason to waste the meter. Uh, the wager one bar. Flash kind of needs meter here. There we go. Knocks him down. Oh, wake up slide. You have got to respect it. 2-2 two, two into the freeze. Going to jump forward. 1-1-2. One, one, Daggers. He's got a guess here. Oh, wow. You can actually blow that up with armor also. Very nice. Right back into it, though. See, though, there he tried to guess on the wake up. Yeah. And he paid for it even then with the mind game. Now he's got uh, uh now he's got trait moving. Wow, he could have got something going there, but just Now he's in trouble. One uh, hit. One hit will do it. And yeah, that'll Good do avoiding it. there. Now there again, that was another instance where people have been wanna have been saying we want the interactables banned in tournament. As you saw there, able to avoid the interactable by backing up. Yeah. Uh, again, my opinion, uh, interactable should stay on. Even in the situation with the pig, I've seen it avoided. I mean, it's got to be really high in the air. I think Batman can double jump over it, uh, right? A couple of characters can avoid the pig. Uh, okay. Okay, so here we go. Oh, here we go. Launches him. Drops the combo. Does, wow. Yeah, it does not convert. Now that slide is minus four, so you will get a chance to check her. A very risky wake-up attack there, but it pays now, off. Flash is one of the only characters that can punish the slide, right? No, Flash cannot punish oh, the slide. Oh, you're talking about Flash's slide. Now Flash's wake-up attack is six frames. Oh, that, that attack right there is six frames, but Killer Frost slide is only minus four. Minus four, right. Oh, beats them. Beats, beats the, the slide. Uh, yeah, there we go. Got him in the corner. Does he? Uh, no, it does not activate trait. Now, I don't oh, use... Oh, gotta always block low there. And there we go, wake-up attack. So, Dr. Handsome right now in control. Activates time loop. There's no combo off of it. I, and you can now keep in mind you can push block Flash when he's in time loop, and the push block will automatically knock him out of it. Deactivate the wow. time. Wow! All yes. right. So now there we go. Nothing but zoning here, and that's smart. Want to keep him away at this moment. Makes yeah. him waste his trait. Now he's in, up three, up three, two, two. No, goes right into a standing one into the iceberg. And, that, oh, no, not yet. And Super! She's going to miss that. Misses it. Swing and a miss. No but punish by Flash, though. Oh. Apparently, Polo saying Hawk Girl can punish the slide. Now we get trolled. Oh, yeah, Pig. I was talking about the Pig on Injustice. When I said I'm glad we exposed the Pig at Civil War, I didn't mean Pig of the Hut. I meant oh, the Pig stage. All right. <laughs> <laughs> I, pig blown up? I, wow. Pig, yeah, pig, it gets, it, it, it pig is, gets blown up? Because you say the Pig, <laughs> and people are like, oh, we're talking about Pig of the Hut. Nah, Pig of the Hut's cool. All right, so we got one nothing. 
We got one nothing and a lot of yelling going on in the background. Yeah, Maxter, I think he is. I think Black Adam's one of the best in the game. No, two different players now. Ah, two different. All right, so maybe I was wrong on that. All right, hold on one moment. Let me get some names. I'll get some changes for you. Hold on. Why do people don't think Bane has... Because people want instant gratification. That's why people... I mean, there are characters where you actually... The stuff is there, but you have to look for it. And people just kind of want, you know... They want the easy button, I guess. I don't know. Not the easy button, but they want to look... They want uh, instant gratification. They want something they can just hop on and whatever. And Bane uh, is really good, so... Uh, you got, but you got to put some time into them and come up with your own stuff and your setups. And you got to know what your options are and what your opponent's options are and what, the, what they're going to do to counter you and all that stuff. And if you don't do that, it's going to be a long day. So uh, just because something takes a little more time invested does not necessarily mean that, it's not as, that they're not good. Listen, you and I are from the old school. We played, tournament, we played games in the arcade where you had to spend your money to learn combos, to practice everything. Yeah. You know, that's back back then that everything took time to learn yeah. because you just didn't have, you couldn't sit in the middle of, uh, you could not sit in the middle of, uh, I guess they're going right in. Yeah, and I will say that Green Lantern players right now are not optimizing on their damage. Uh, that's a fact. They basically right now do the wrong combos. They don't have meter when they need it. Um, meter burn lift. And that's what I mean. Meter burn lift, back three, jumping three, two, two, three, left. There we go. There's a good combo. 32% finishes him off with the meter burn rocket. J Rosa looking very good right now in full control. Now, meter burn rockets, I don't care. I mean, those air rockets, I don't care. I will dash forward all day, knock him out of the air. I, I can get. The only thing I'm worried about with Green Lantern is not even the left. It's the meter burn rocket. In my opinion, the meter burn rocket is the best projectile in the game. Now I tested it. I tested it with Dark Rob. Maybe I was just over anticipating, but I was able to block the the lift on reaction just at the first few frames of the lift that I Absolutely saw. Absolutely not. That move is ten so frames, fast, right? Yes, ten frames. Surrender. Maybe and it was just because I was over anticipating, just trying to you know guess when he was going to do it. And it throws him into that green brick wall. J Rose are looking good there. We got a class who's wagering what? Yeah, he's got to wager that bar. Got 33. So how do you play, uh, Bill? Do you play on uh, Street Fighter Control or MK Control? MK Control. Okay. I personally recommend the MK Control because I feel like, with the exception of the back forward moves, it almost feels like the Street Fighter Control is built into the MK Control, but not vice versa. Yeah. Uh, oh, there's Jay Rose. He's going to take the first game. Um, I think I thought about going to Street Fighter Control after next level when I was playing Chris E and I basically had the match one. All I had to do was do back one, two and chip him out. With it. And I guess I, I, I did um, back one and then I went to do quarter circle forward and yet somehow me rolling it came out as back forward two. I don't know. So I'm thinking about, I, I definitely mis-executed there and I'm thinking about doing the alternate controls just so I p can prevent those execution errors on my part. It's just a palette swap, uh, CRT Jones. It, just a costume change, that's all. And Jay Rosa stepping up here. Overhead. Swing and a miss. Yeah, you want to do back two, three meter burn rocket up that. And that's the wrong combo also. And you don't want to do that either. That is terrible. 
Well, what could they do to improve on that? Uh, you don't want to use both your meter and your trade unless there are certain... <laughs> there are set of combos. Look at this guy. Notice his meter is empty. Now, uh, this is right. the problem that a lot of Green Lanterns are running into, is they're running into empty meter syndrome. Uh, because they're not optimizing on their Green Lantern combos. However, in the Prima Guide, the Green Lantern optimized combos are there. That is the exact order you want to do your combo. Now, just a question. Who wrote that Prima Guide? Uh, it was three of us. We all worked very hard on it. Myself, Carlin Jr. Each man pulled his own weight, and each guy worked really, really hard. A lot of sleepless nights on myself, Carlin Jr.'s point. I can tell you that right now. Well, uh, I, you know, I, I, I actually did buy the, uh, the, the collector's edition, the hardcover. Man, uh, my last night's there. Uh, ah, pig power. They did, John. You're right. Absolutely. Our last night there, I remember Junior and myself and Carl were there at like 7 a.m. Uh, trying to get stuff done. We just we didn't even sleep. We just stayed in the office. Now that chandelier, is that an interactable? Can that be thrown? Yes, it can. It can also be meter burn. Yeah, see, and then does it go straight down or more on a diagonal? Uh, it'll cover straight down in a slight angle. Yeah, with Green Lantern, you don't want to come into what I call empty meter syndrome. Uh, there's a certain order you want to do things. Like if you hit a forward and three, you would do back one three meter burn rocket. Uh, then another back one three lift or one two three lift for 35 or 36 percent. Okay. If you hit a meter burn forward and three, you wouldn't then use the back one through one three meter burn rocket. That's two bars you spent there. You right. Would then have your trade. Plus you lost your yeah, and some people will throw a trade in there too. You would use your trait. You would use if range. You would do meter burn rocket back one three trait lift two two three lift. Right. That's 34 percent. I need I need some stream matches. Though. I need to know who's going on. Oh. oh. Oh, I'm up next. I'm up next. All right, Tom Brady coming on. I think we're going to have M Mike Metroid jumping up on the uh, stream with us. Hello, everyone. Player one, what's your name? Ether. 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 Ether, E-T-H-E-R. E -E 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 That is right, Dizzy made an appearance at Red Bank, New Jersey for Yestercades. Man, this game. There's no forward three, it, and it, it's not good anyway. I mean, every time I do it, he just does this weird overhead attack. I don't get it. Every character. So, Mike, turn and look at the screen. Say hi to everybody. Hello, everyone. Here is your wonderful pink-colored Mike Metroid. What's going Rock, on? Rocking the ECT sweatshirt. There it is, ECT5 coming up. Next month, May 18th, May 19th. Uh, it's ran by John Gallagher, a.k.a. Sweet Johnny Cage. Thank you. And Joe Camilleri. Is I said that right? Camilleri? Yeah. Joe Charmelli. Joe Charmelli, that's yes, right. And he also would, known as L.I. Joe. Yes, ECT5 coming up this this May, May 18th and 19th in Morristown, New Jersey. The week before, however, on the Edge 3, May 11th, which is a qualifier for ECT5. And now, and not only will that get you free registration, but I, I'm pretty sure it's free hotel as well. Is that free hotel? No, no, no not free hotel. hotel. Free registration to the game, well. And venue fee? It's venue fee. And to the game, if you win the game, the tournament of the which tournament you enter. Okay. So, so. If, you, if you win MK9, you'll get MK9. Mm -hmm. uh, but you're only allowed to win one venue fee. Mm -hmm. Well, let's look at this match right now. Is this a button check? Ah, no, this is a button check. Now, I did get a chance to talk to Ether before we started, and uh, he said last time he played in the tournament was uh, EVO 2011, and he played MK9. Shazam. Looks like we're going to the uh, Arkham Asylum. It's not the mess hall, so no pigs. No one's throwing pigs just yet. Tom, get that pig thrown. Throw that pig. Begin. Here we go, begin. 
He's looking to uh, rush down at first. Then oh, gonna back up. Here comes trying to zone him out. Not working. Goes Good. right for the interactable, and it doesn't work. Scoop. Meter burn. Goes for a little bit more. Put him back up in the air. Probably going to wake up. Oh, don't, no wake up at all. Back three into a jump. There we go. Nice Boom. Perfect overhead. He didn't get the free uh, grab after that. Misses the interactable. Yep, and Brady showing again that you can avoid these interactables. Now he's pushing them back here. By pushing them back, he puts them near the more the other interactables. And right now, Brady just zoning. He's got the lead. He can just stay back, but not anymore. Gets caught on the meter burn. Ether misses his interactable. And he's going to get blown up for it. Tom Brady going up with the cross up. Both of them are on their second life ball now. Nice teleport, trying to avoid. Still gets hit by the trident though. Ether should have punished that. Only got a sweep though. Here we go, got some throw mix ups. Psycho Crusher. He's back up in the air. Uh -oh. Blown up this time. Full combo. Meter burn, scoop. Scoop, all right. Now he's got Jump full in. meter. A little bit of a tick throw there. This game does have those. Ooh. Meter burn back three does He's not gotta, work. There you go. Get wager. that health back. Get that health back. I don't expect Brady to wager anything. He doesn't need to. He doesn't need to. He's got enough of advantage. All right. So they're almost even right now. No meter on either side. Oh, and here comes the combo. Let's see them scoops. No, he didn't throw them back. Yep, That's bop, a good bop, bop, <laughs> and there you go. Nah, bump. he set him up for that. Moved yeah. in, went right in for the meaty into the meter burn. So one nothing, Tom Brady. <laughs> All right, here we go. Scooping him up, throwing him around. Aquaman's getting the upper hand on Shazam right now. Ether's got to do something quick because it looks like Brady's inside of his his head. At least he gets an EX Psycho Crusher. No interactables on the stage right now, though. And it is the second round already. Tom Brady showing a huge advantage over Ether right now. Ether doesn't know, doesn't seem to know what he's uh, trying to fight against. At least he's getting the Psycho Crushers. Which hit overhead randomly. It's pretty nice. Scoop, scoop, scoop. Now the one thing I will say, I, I do have standing near me. I have phase three standing near me, and phase three, he actually plays Shazam. Mm. I played I played a little bit of Shazam. Like I originally wanted to, I played his Shazam and MK versus DC, and he was just a hype character, but um, I'm not liking him right now. Right. I'm well, not liking him. I mean, if you're a Bison player, I'm sure. Uh, oh, yeah. Oh, swing and a miss on the freeze. Uh-oh. In the corner. Gets blown up for the missed. Uh, but he uses his trait. Kind of get out of jail free card there. Going to go for a back three. Does he uh. going to finish him with it? No, he does not. Right out of there. Goes for a little bit of zone. Puts himself back in the chip corner. Chip damage for the, the win. chip damage does finish him off. Okay. And uh, Tom Brady won. I didn't expect that at all. Yeah. <laughs> So, uh, shout outs to stream chat. How's everyone doing? And I believe I have a tournament match. So, shout outs to Down Fortality. I have a match, guys.
Okay, so as you can see, we have Rio coming up. Uh, looks like we may have a Batman mirror. Got a Batman Beyond costume going on. Now where is where is Rapzilla? Is Rapzilla around here? Rapzilla should be calling this match. Long Island Joe, do you want to come do some commentary with me? Joe can't help himself. He's got to be on the mic. He loves it. Okay, so on the mic with me now, I have Long Island Joe. Say what's up to everybody, Joe. Hello. Oh, my God. I hate my side profile. You guys <laughs> see my side profile? <laughs> that thing is so bad. Okay, so we have EMP Rio versus Antiquarian. Rio going with the Batman Beyond costume, I believe. That's a cool outfit. No, nope, I think I have the names reversed. Okay, so I've got the names reversed, so I will change that for you momentarily. There we go. All right, guys. Uh, first, I want to say is that I don't know how good my commentary is going to be. I could probably just make you guys laugh maybe here and there. But there we go. As far as serious commentating, it's, I don't know a lot about I the game. <laughs> I'm still learning myself, so... Uh, at the moment, though, Rio up quite a bit. and Almost a full life bar, three-quarters of a life bar. Bounces him off the interactable and zoning out with Batarangs and uh, Trait Bats. Oh, it's crazy that you can't duck that. Like, you know, a lot of projectiles you can duck, yeah. but you cannot duck the Wow. Bats. He's just totally keeping oh. him at bay right now. Not much he can do. Trying to rezone and counter zone. Did you see I was playing uh, Sweet Johnny Cage and some Super yeah, Turbo I earlier? I saw that. I saw that. I played you in Super Terrible before. I can hold my own. I'm okay. <laughs> Your old Sagat using whore. Yeah, that's me. <laughs> I agree you also. Sometimes. <laughs> so Rio going up one nothing. Rio's a gangster. I was playing. Uh, is it the same kid I was playing? No, I was playing a different Nightwing with Batman, and yeah. I was having a really hard time when he got in on me. Oh, really? Really hard time. Okay. A so lot of push blocking, yeah. I'm guessing. Okay. Goes right to Aquaman. Oof. Runs away to Aquaman. Oof. You know, I'm wondering, maybe he had his buttons wrong? That's really? quite possible. Oh, man, I'd be so mad. I thought that happened my first game <laughs> when I almost lost to the Catwoman. <laughs> like, my buttons better not be wrong. <laughs> I'm going to be upset. What's going on, Zato? My diet's doing very well. I'm down 84 pounds. <laughs> Testers go away. That's funny. <laughs> yeah, there's a lot of those kinds around here. Did Rio test? Uh, yes. What a G. Now, I believe that is, is if I remember correctly, this is the Damian Wayne uh, Nightwing. I thought the long hair. One. I have no oh, idea. All right. I Neither, don't know. I don't really know either, I really don't know. but I know they're both Nightwing. Yeah, they're Damian Wayne and Dick Grayson. That's all I know. All right. Here's what I, I, a lot of people say in band the testers. Here's what I'm going to say about the testers. Do they come in with a somewhat in unfair advantage? Absolutely. Um, but them coming in and playing... What it does 
is it gives the everybody does get better quicker. Everybody gets an opportunity to see higher level yeah. play earlier, and everybody can evolve faster because of it. For instance, everybody was complaining about the interactables. Now, because of the testers and seeing how they avoid them, almost everybody knows how to avoid interactables, and the game's two weeks old. Yeah, Art, Art told me at the at the Daigo exhibition how to do it. He was like, yeah, just either focus or like the, the focus thing or just backdash. Right. So, you know, it, it's not like there are aren't plus sides to it. Um, you know, the testers, you know, the testers definitely have an, a slight advantage, absolutely. But that does see uses the interactable there to get over the batarangs, and he still can if he wants to. Smart dashing there, showing it can be done. The other player was, he was in the staff stance a lot more. Yeah, that's that that shenanigan. Oh. Like, oi, got the back dash. Yeah, you can jab out of that. Pokes him out of that, yep. Rio having a little bit of a hard time right yep, now. Yep, see that? At least it's not a low. Now he's zoning. Gonna see if he's able to, uh... Oh yeah, he's got way too much bar. Yep. <laughs> is that game or what? That is game. All right, so we need another. Uh, okay. We need I'm, another. I'm confused. Maybe the buttons were wrong oh, that first game. Uh, oh, the first game. Yeah, yeah, the first game. Okay, so that first match, Rio actually gave it uh, gave it away and basically said it didn't count because the buttons were wrong and they didn't save. So now it is officially one zero. Please, guys, excuse my look. I feel like doo doo butter. I probably look like doo doo butter also. Oh, oh, this uh, guy. right into the interactable. Oh. See what? now. Oh no. What I will say is, oh, oh, using the interactable, looking good there. Almost three quarters of a life bar ahead. What I will say is this, everybody was saying Nightwing was going to be a problem coming in up on Test Your Might all week long. Nightwing's an issue. Nightwing's a problem. Look at Nightwing. Nightwing is crazy. Look at Batman. Look at what he's doing to Nightwing. So as you can see, this game is going to be a little bit matchup based. Wow. But you see the way into Quarian, he closed that gap and now he's in. R Rio forcing the issue though. If you're gonna get on me, I'm gonna make you get off of me. Wow. Swing and a miss on the combo, though. That's so good. And Aquarian closes That's the really distance. Good. Rio runs away. Looks for that meter burn. Oh, wall bounce. Oh. Oh, that button's so good. About even on meter here. That's a wrap. There's no way to win. It's a wrap. Yep, and that's going to do it. Rio that's does so take the game. I really like the setup, the comic setup you got. Like the layout, it's cool. I appreciate that. Have you have you seen the? I gotta show you the dual one, but yeah, I mean, obviously you've seen this before. <laughs> Meanwhile, back at Combat Network headquarters, Joe saying hi to everybody. <laughs> look at how bad my side profile is. Everyone, take a look at that. Ah, oh, you look fine, Joe. See that schnauzer? I appreciate that, Black Yellow. Thank you. Got a fairly big profile match coming up. Jailhouse took fourth at uh, bit not Big Two, but uh, what's the name of it? Over at Big Two. Yeah. Did uh, he? Yeah, he took wow. fourth there the other day. Was at VSM on Thursday, and now he's here playing KT Smith. Green Lantern Doomsday. Green Lantern. I will destroy you all. Ooh, Bane. KT 
Oh, right? goodness. Okay. Kyle Jordan. Check your butts. So cheap. <laughs> Frame traps for days. That's cheap. So how do you play? Do you play on MK layout or uh, uh, MK uh, controller or Street Fighter control? I play uh, on MK actually. I, I you know I, I again feel like, I, I feel like it's harder on MK. I mean Street Fighter. Well, you know the thing is, I think that a back forward motion is more natural than a half circle forward. Um, I, I just feel like the inputs don't like. I feel like I do stuff and it doesn't come out. I'm like I know how to do a quarter circle forward. Very true. Um, I'm a little confused. All right. There, there are no Aries players. No Aries players. <laughs> KT Smith, they're saying you look like Lobo in human form. It's Lobo Smith. That's pretty sick. What's up, Red? All right, so we got zoning. Zoning for days. Looks like, almost looks like... <laughs> it looks like an Akuma match. Air fireballs. I don't like this fight. Why not? I don't know. I don't like it. Oh, my goodness. I usually like mirror matches, too. Wow. So, Joe, are you ready for ECT5? Of course I'm ready for ECT5. <laughs> You coming out on the edge? Uh, yeah, probably. Atta boy. You gonna play? Uh, maybe. Win a, uh, I'm gonna free entry yeah. fee to your <laughs> <one> <laughs> tournament? No, I forgot I can't play. I forgot about that. Well, you can play. You just have yeah, to, just you, you would second. have to give it to second place. That's all. Oi. Oh, goodness gracious. Me on mine. I, I love the interactable on this stage. I love the cannonball. It's so fun. They got to use it. Somebody do the cannonball. Oh, wait. I think he... Does he do the cannonball? I think he might throw the cannon. Right. Meter burn off the wall. Swing and a miss on the back end of the combo. Meter burn oh throws the cannon. No. Oh, goodness. Cheap stuff. Oh, goodness. Shoot him. Shoot them. Oh, what a gangster. Got to come down. Oh, wow. Okay. So, Jailhouse taking round uh, first match. Hello is power. Yellow is definitely power. Is he going to burn it? Yeah, he burns it. Is that punishable? Um, I'm not sure. I'm still learning this game, too. Oh, wow. Nice lift there. No use into the interactables. There we go. As quickly as I said it, they did it. Cool. Me meter burns that. More zoning. Tries to meter oh, burn. Goodness. The missile doesn't work. Oh no, get oh, him. He uses that to get over. Oh. Again with the knee. Nice. I like it. I like the play. Oh. Meter burns oh, the uh, my tree. Oh goodness gracious. He gave him his log. <laughs> oh. Oh, good. Oh. The high low. Oh, punish lifter. 
you, you can definitely lift, lift. See now. Oh, goodness. Jailhouse gets yeah, it. Yeah, Jailhouse, really good. I got to give it to him. He's doing really, really well. Actually, a threat to win this tournament. We'll see how he does against the likes of Rio and Brady, though. Rio and Brady. Those guys. Yo, I feel like butt. So coming up, we have Jay Rosa, who you saw before against the Ghost of Injust Cast, also known as. <laughs> it makes me laugh. That's going to be uh, Claude Von Stroke. Got to give a quick shout out here to uh, all of our different affiliates and sponsors, Ultraspec Cables. Check them out at ultraspec.us. Uh, Mad Cats, who has helped supply us with a bunch of, you know, Mark Man's an awesome guy. Every yeah, time I dude. see him at a tournament, he's like, Phil, here's a stick. I, I, he's been awesome with that. Yeah, so I got I to say thank you to him because he really, that's why I got to put his, uh, his uh, uh, logo up here. Because every time I turn around, he's like, yeah, I'll give you something. So I, a big thank you to him. Uh, obviously, you guys know we do VSM every Thursday at the Gamer's Edge. Crown Trophy, where I work. If New Hyde Park, anytime you need something, give us a call, 516-775-5755. I'm kind of like the manager over there. So let you know if you call and you're from the uh, fighting game community, ask specifically for me and we'll get you some kind of, uh, some kind of discount. Uh, Yestercades is where we are right now for uh, <laughs> Project Injustice. Um, ECT5, Joe, you want to give us a little uh, rundown? ECT5. Attaboy. We're at five. Five. Yeah, it's amazing. Holy goodness. And May 18th and 19th in the same hotel. Yep. Um, I have to shout out just about everybody on there. I can't even do a shout out. There's too many people. Uh, Phil helps. Everyone helps. Ultra Spec Cables helps. Madcast definitely helps. You make the trophies. Yeah, we've done yeah, the awards man. for five it's years yeah, for you guys it's, now. It's, I can't even. Yeah, there's too many people. <laughs> it really is. It's just about everybody. You know, and, and, and ECT holds a huge place in the hearts of Mortal Kombat. And, and that's because ECT is where I think mainstream UMK3 really became widely known. ECT2, me vs. Shock. Yes, un unbelievable. And then followed that up right after that with Road to Evo. That was good, too. That was insane. It's still one of the most watched UMK3 matches on YouTube. Really? That and you versus uh, AC 1984. Oh, my goodness. Unbelievable. Really? Holy unbelievable. goodness. Unbelievable. Thank you, guys. One of the most watched UMK3 matches of all time. I'm honored, actually. So, uh, and of course, the Fall Classic. The Fall Classic, same thing. Another tournament run by uh, me and John. Plus, we have the East Coast Big the Guns. The East Coast Monsters. Yep. Larry Schimblanka and Huge Big Eric. <laughs> <laughs> so, we are coming together to e run Eric the Fall is, Classic. Eric is one of those guys I probably would not want to arm wrestle. I, I don't even like looking at him wrong. <laughs> yeah. yeah, that, that guy has, uh, he, you know... <laughs> yeah, he's got biceps for yeah, days. That guy's scary. His biceps are bigger than like me. Yeah, that's a big dude. Um Just big shout out to my guy and my boys over at Kick Punch Block. Wanna say hi to everybody over there. They like to play some King of Fighters. Joe, you gotta come down oh, on a Thursday team. night. You guys seriously King of Fighters. that when when KPB is at VSM with us, um they do King of Fighters for you know Which the same one? KOF 13? You got to come down and play with us. You get some injustice in as well. What are we doing about stages? Are we picking them? Like they're supposed to be. They're supposed to be um, not picked. The first one is whatever the sh uh, the yeah. one is. It's supposed to be that way, but they're not doing it. And I, I should. Somebody's got to go spank those guys because they're being bad boys. Oh goodness. Oh boy, Joe, you're on that. I'm not doing it. I'm not doing it either. <laughs> 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 All right, That's so definitely not punishable though. What the slide? Yeah. No, not punishable. Definitely not punishable. Overhead. Is uh, this a match? Two, two, and yet we're in match now. Does Are not need sure? a burnout. Did not have enough. Yes, we're definitely in match. Meter burns you. 
Does not have enough. Now, he should have gone with the back three before the meter burn. Yeah, I don't know about that. Good Forward 1-1-2 one, one, into daggers. He's going to have to guess. Overhead, he guesses wrong. Slide misses. I'm, I'm definitely going to lose to this character. Who, to Killer Frost? Yeah. After, after the forward 1-1-2 one, one, into daggers, you have to guess up or down. That's cheap. Meter oh, burn. Block. Nobody using that. Uh, Why is that safe? That's, not, that's punishable, Slide yes. Slide up three, and that is going to do it for the first uh, life bar. I see a lot of people not punishing that. Trait lift. Or even just trait. They don't do anything. That's punishable also. Yeah, no, they should be. If, if you do back one, three trait, that's mad punishable. Can't really zone here. Checks him with the guy, the iceberg. Meter burn. Dash oh is no. in. Nothing doing, oh though. Slide up three, good. up three. Does not get the two, two. Wake up lift. Back, back three. three. And wager. a wager. Sorry about this lady. Do it, do it. And it is Killer Frost who comes away with that one. Wow. Two, three. Meter burn, back three. Jumping three misses. Gravity's too high. Up three, two, two, and we're going to get another wager. Both doing it. Triangle on both. Flash tied. Again, oh. Killer Frost taking it. No use of the uh, no use of the interactable. I guess he does not know that the crystal oh. ball is uh, an interactable. Oh, no. Could be it. Oh no. Punish. Oh no, you can't punish that. That was sick. And the Ghost of Injust cast does take the first match. Killer Frost. <laughs> Summoning Nid Butani. Get him out here. He is the man. He is the man. Summoning really is the man. We are, honestly, we are some of the luckiest people on the planet to know Nit. Yeah, I agree. I knew him when I was like 10 years old. <laughs> yeah, he, he's, he's awesome. And you know what's funny is uh, I have probably crossed paths with him for, I don't know, close to 15 or 20 years. Really? You know, he lived on Long Island for God yeah, knows yeah, how yeah. long, and he used to play at the same arcades, and then he moved out to New Jersey, and I went to college out in New Jersey, and we used to both play in the Bloomfield, New Jersey arcade, and we must have passed, you know, passed yeah. each other a million times. 2-2 two, two into meter burn freeze. No, no meter burn. I guess he didn't have the meter quite yet. Throw into the corner. Again, no use of the interactable. Both of them had an opportunity, and just don't, don't go for it. Oi. That time they do. No jump into the interactable. Not oh my using god, it. that's so good. The overhead is so good. Yes, it is. Killer Frost got some frost up there. Now Green Lantern to go. Oh, okay, no, we're not going to use it. Slide. 2-2. Two, two. And we're going to see the meter burn here. Forward 1-1-2 one, one, into daggers. Overhead does get blocked that time. Oh use no. Use of the meter of uh, the interactable not working. 2-2. Two, two, uh, and a wager this time. He has no choice. I don't see how much meter they have. And this time, uh, Rosa takes that one. Up three, up three, two, two. No, does wow, not go into it. Punishable. Oh, slide should have been right there. Wow, good trade. Do it. Back three. Yes. Yep. Splat. Splat. The pig. The pig. Backs up right away, looking for some pig advantage. He's doing the right thing. He's got mad bar. Oh, I would have just... Uh, wager that time. This time, she takes it. Not use it. There it goes. He's going to interactable wow, that time. got him. Oh, he dropped uh, it. Wastes his, uh, his oh trade, but he still has enough to get this. Back three, and nothing doing. Oh. Meter burn does not hit. He did not. He wow. checked it. How did he just lose? So we're tied up. 
Get some reaction out of here. <laughs> Meter burnt bacon out of Red Rum. <laughs> Joe, have you had an opportunity to meet Red Rum? Uh, I'm not sure. Have I ever met Red Rum? Uh, I'm not sure. He, well, a good friend of mine, known him for uh, like 10 years. He's been playing softball with me for like 10 years. Really? Yeah. <laughs> oh wow, we got we got Jay Rosa fans right now. Make this count, brother. I like it. Mix it up. Sick. Oh, why did you drop that? Why are you doing this to me? Meter burns that, stopping him from being able to zone. Oof. Could have got underneath. crazy meter, though. Yep. Watch the interactable back there. That shit is ridiculous. Oh. Up three, two, two, and that puts him down for the first life bar. Oh, oh looks uh, for the parry. What is that shit? Oh, come on, let me see something. One, one, two. Tell him what he got. Oh. Overhead, does block it. Good that's move too, there. That's Up three, too good, two, man. two, and a wager. That's really too good. That slide is ridiculous. Like, when you jump and he does it, you can't hit her. You know what I'm saying? Like, on the way down? Yeah, no, it's... It's that's crazy talk. Rio showed me some crazy stuff with Killer Frost. There's, like, you can do her... Uh, you can do her trait. You can cancel out of her trait. And Jab, da right? Well, you can dash cancel out of her trait. So you can do, like, trait, dash... Uh, or you can... You, I think you can cancel certain specials out of the, the trait as well. So you can do trait parry in the corner. Uh. So if they try to wake up Frozen. So the ghost of Injust Cast, he does take this one. Good game. Good game both players. A very rare appearance of Dark Rob on stream versus Tom Brady. Let's go, Robert. I'll be a little biased. Okay, so now, obviously, you guys are very well aware. Tom Brady and Dark Rob, good friends. So there is a distinct possibility that if uh, Brady has been hanging out with Dark Rob, Dark Rob might have an idea of what he's doing. We'll get a chance to see now. I've never fought an Aquaman. You're on deck on stream. Sick. So, L.I. Joe on deck on stream. Let's play some Injustice. Okay, I think we're getting a button check right now. Yeah, we definitely have a button check. Check those butts. Oh, I see Mob Fan. That's a guy in my stream. What up, Mob Fan? I see you right there, bro. There he is. Um, Factor, we have, I think we have a, a little over 30 tonight. So, of course, let's finish off here. Of course, you guys know my, my boys at VSM and Test Your Might. And the On Blast Show every Tuesday night, 10 p.m. And, of course, the guys over at MKU, Mortal Kombat United. 
Mm. Let's go. Dark Rob does know how to convert those uh, Green Lantern combos, so do not be uh, surprised to see him pulling off some pretty big Green Lantern combos. You have to block that low. Uh, I'm not sure. Meter burns the, from the deep. 34% damage. Looking for that overhead. 2-3. Nice Good block. Oh, oh, able to jump over it. Oh, lift. Uppercut nice. into it. Trait. Meter burns it. Hit him. Yes. Interactable. That may put him down for the round. I don't know. I think he's going to be alive gonna by be, a little bit. Yeah, a little. going to be close. Oh, meter burns it. Oh, my and God. Brady. Able to uh, overcome it. He takes the first life bar. Punishes the jump kick. Oh. Zapped. That's cheap. <laughs> 44 percent damage wow. and the interactable again uh, or the transition I should say Rob looking like he's gonna have to uh, nope he just takes it he could have won the wager right away he had the meter for it this character's mad good so Tom Brady going up one to nothing does anybody know if that's you gotta block that low? Whatever that thing is where he let's hits go, the floor. Yeah, let's go from the deep. Jump in. Does not meet a burner. And oh, good guess there. Trident is a low. Thank you, gentlemen. Trait active. 32% looking good. Makes it a little bit safer there. Good uh, lift check. Meter burn back three. Jump in three. Looks for the cross up, does not convert. Oh. From the deep meter burn. Scoop. Puts that's him on the down. Damage. 40%. That's that's MK style damage. Trait and gets punished for it. Forty percent wow. again. Oh, Rob go. is gonna have to convert on a big combo to pull, put himself back in it right now. He guesses jump, but a check does it. Jump in, and that is nice. it. He converts on the big combo, puts uh, Brady down. Now we're fairly even. Oh, he just wasted his meter. I might have saved it for Clash if he did it. Yeah, but you know what? Green Lantern can build meter fairly quickly from zoning, so. And he's already at three now. Nice. Oh, wow. Brady may have to go uh, Clash soon. Make a count. No punish! Wow. This time we get it. Is Rob gonna... Oh, he drops the combo. Playing head games now. Easy. Looking for a lift check. Oh, no. Next combo, we're gonna see the wager. Does Rob wager? No, he does not. No wager on that. Wow. Whoa. Wait. Yeah. Crazy stuff. Lift check. Yeah. Oh, and he puts him down. Good stuff out of Rob, though. Looking pretty good there. Rob just got knocked out of winners. And we're pretty deep into this tournament. So, Rob looking really solid there. Okay, Joe, thanks for doing a little commentary. We'll have you on stream right now. Yeah, sorry about the flickering, guys. The flickering is actually um, the the HDMI splitter is not the, grass, uh, the greatest. So we have KT Smith, Human Lobo, coming on to commentate with me. That's a pretty serious compliment to whoever said that, so thank you. Uh, unfortunately, I choked in that first match against Jailhouse. I thought for I th sure... I, I think it was Red Rum, by the way, who said it. Oh, really? Yeah. Uh, after I hit him with the turbine at the end, I thought it was over. So, I... S 
Shout out to the House of Goons, all you guys down there. Job, EP, Ice, Jaeger, Funk, Benito, all the goons, man. Mm. Oh, and I can't forget Biako, man. I can't forget Yak. Love all you goons. So you guys seen enough Green Lantern mirrors yet? <laughs> Yo, for the core. Once a Green Lantern, always a Green Lantern, etc., etc. Okay, so uh, is it true? Okay, so apparently in winner's top eight, we have the ghost of Injust cast. God. That would be Claude Von Schmuck. My, I'm so powerful, my ghost is in top eight. Oh, wow, okay. Damn. How does it feel to be back from the dead? I'm still a corpse. Oh, how does yeah. it feel to be back from the dead? It's all right. All right. It's all right. Was it better dead, though? It's all right. Eh. Well, I mean, when I was dead, I was playing lots of Capcom games, so I learned a lot. Okay. I understand. The reason I have to say this is because I have to play Rio probably next. So I have to enjoy this while it lasts, is all I'm saying. And I'm going to get bodied anyway, so. All right. Hold that shit. So, Troy's in winner's top eight. I guess that makes me loser's top eight. You still, might have to go one more ma one more uh, round oh, really? to go top eight. I don't know yet. I just don't want to have to fight Magneto halfway in his Who does he cyborg. Use? Cyborg. Oh, can he? A can character he, I've never played can before. Can he instant air fireball? Uh, it's probably not going to matter. I have no idea what to do against <laughs> that character. Uh, I think we have a button check going on right now. No, I think Li Joe is going to be using Doomsday. I have a feeling we're going to see Doomsday. I hope so. I've seen the sick of Green Lantern. I, I love Doomsday. Are you playing Doomsday now? I play a. If I play Doomsday, you mean I know how to do EX shoulder charge and down one Earth shake? Then yeah, <laughs> that's that, that's all. You, that's all you need to know to play Doomsday. Doomsday. All right, so I guess they're starting it up now. Got Rio the Batman against Long Island Joe. Green Lantern. Gets caught by the bomb at the back of back 2-3. Joe zoning here. Yeah, this is going to turn out bad for him if he keeps trying to throw stuff across the screen. <laughs> yep, Batman can dash under it. Uses, wow, very good use of those bats. Yeah, Batman is terrifying like that because you never know what's safe and what's not safe. When he's got bats out, it's terrifying to press any buttons at all because he can let them go at any time. And he builds him back up so fast. Yeah. Jogo should go for the flower, throw the flower at him. He's not doing it. Needs some more interactable use. There it, there is. it is. He heard you. <laughs> Lift check and nothing doing. He gets blown up for it. Yeah, he's going to get chipped out now. Yep. Now Rio's just going to turtle. Yeah, he doesn't and really Green have Lan to. Yeah, Green Lantern has no way to get in now. This match is basically over. <laughs> Rio oh, way to jump over that, though. He read that. Rio going in. Doesn't, he doesn't really need to. Feeling himself. That's punishable. That's disgusting. <laughs> Taking a whole lot of chip. Dangerous to press any buttons because he had a bat. Oh, yeah. By the way, everybody, if you haven't noticed, uh, tomorrow, take an opportunity. If you, if you, I'm, not to, I'm not advertising for Toys R Us, but if you do go to Toys R Us, you can pick up Injustice for $35. So those of you who don't have it, take a chance, an opportunity to pick it up for a low cost. Yeah, I think this is probably Green Lantern's only losing matchup. I think Green Lantern has oh, advantage. Oh, freezes him. Yeah. Uses the, the interactable. The, the freeze scales heavily, really, really heavily. But it's I'm not going to matter because his life bar is going to be I'm actually going to anyway. go to Toys R Us at some point tomorrow, too, and pick up another copy just to make sure I have three at BSM. Damn is he going to jump up and throw the face immediately? Nope. Yeah, this is horrible, horrible for Green Lantern. Stay down. He tells him to stay down. Yeah. So, Rio going up one nothing. Rio, of course, with immaculate trait management from Batman, and when playing a Batman with good trait management, it's possible to do basically anything. Begin. 
<laughs> Hits him with the glitter, <laughs> glitter bomb. Personally, my favorite move from Batman. Instant the air glitter bombs the all glitter day. glitter bomb. He showers him in stripper dust. <laughs> Rio taking out the interactables just so he can't be thrown at him later, which is pretty smart. I like to do that too. Are we going to see the interactable use? No. Yeah, Joe doesn't seem to be too mindful of the interactables. Probably going to cost him. I'm so... There he goes. Misses it, though. I'm so using that. Calling that from now on. It is instant air stripper dust. Yeah. The only move that I can, like, sort of equate Batman's trait to is, like, Akuma's air fireballs. This, this Batman skin, this is the, uh... This is actually the Batman Beyond skin. It is not confetti. It's stripper dust. Wow. R Rio with those throw techs. Oh, wow. That. There he goes again. Throw he was tags. doing that to me earlier. He was teching all of my throws. It's like I was playing the computer. Yeah, Green Lantern is in a bad way right now. There's basically no coming back from this. No, Rio is not a computer. I have, I have video evidence. You can see him playing there. He's a human being. I have my he's, doubts. He's not AI. You know, he's not from that movie AI. I'm pretty sure he is AI, actually. <laughs> <laughs> so good with the throw techs. Look at that. And Rio does yeah, it. Turtle Batman. Horrible. Horrible yeah. for Green Lantern. Okay, so Rio advances. And next we have Tom Brady coming back on. Jailhouse Brady coming up. Jailhouse, of course, uh, cross Tekken monster for those who don't, who are not aware. Won uh, cross Tekken this week at next level. No small feat. Going in with Ogre and Howrong. What is going on, Zach? Good to see you in the stream. Why don't I play Grunday? Because I, I don't I don't I don't work well with grapplers. <laughs> KT Grundy. <laughs> Isn't metal enough? Well, I mean, Green Lantern's not really metal at all either. I did try out Ares first. I wasn't really feeling him. You know what? Why don't we see if we can get a little guest commentary out of Rio right now? You want sure. to do commentary? Rio's going to jump in all and right. do some... No, he could do some commentary with you. Okay. It's better off that way. Hold on one second. Scoot over a little bit. Rio, come on in. I'm just about to see your side. So what's going on, KT? Nothing much. How many throws do you think you teched that game? Uh, All of them? There were a lot of throws. Did you get thrown once? I don't think so. I think so. in the first round I did. I think so. You no, I think I threw him instead. You are doing that to me earlier, taking all my throws. Oh, yeah, it's because in this game, uh, you have... Do you just react to, like, the camera zooming in? Is that, what I, is that how you yeah, do it? Yeah, in this game, when, you, when someone does a throw, uh -huh. it has, I think, throws have 10 frames of startup. Right. 
And then so you have 10 frames of startup, and then after that you have, I think it's 8 frame or 10 frames, the throw break window, I'm not sure. Uh -huh. But 10 and 10, that's like 20. And then when the camera zooms in, it's you have a pretty big window to break them. Yeah. It takes a while to get used to, but once you get it down, it's, it's pretty simple. It seems like uh, reacting to the camera zoom is the way to go. Yeah. I think the hardest throw to tech in this game would probably be Ravens, because Why? when he throws you... Alright, you know how other characters reach out and grab you, and yeah. you see them physically touching you and grabbing you? Yeah. When she grabs you, it looks like you're getting hit by a, a, like a, one of her telemoves. Mm. Like she looks like she's uh, hitting you with something. Yeah. She'll grab you, and then you'll instantly be have that thing around you. Mm -hmm. So it looks like you got hit by a lift or something. Yeah, I could see that. So just want to give a shout out to Dark Rob. He's actually in Loser's Top 8. Oh, wow, Rob doing in some work. Did he use GL all the way, or did he go in the Aquaman? used only Green Lantern. Damn, wow, that's ev nice. Everybody is using only Green Lantern. Yeah, there's a lot of Green Lantern in this Yeah, so many. Me and, me and Jailhouse got to expose all the fraud Green Lanterns, so they all drop. Oh, Jailhouse characters. plays Yellow Lantern. Damn, Yellow Lantern? Yellow Lantern. Yellow is power. This is going to be a good match, actually. Tom Brady against yeah, Jailhouse. is Jailhouse. really good. Really good. Green Lantern. Sad I didn't beat him, though. Were you, did you see me play him? Were you watching that? No, I don't, I don't think so. It, the very first match, it came down to a... Uh, I hit him with Turbo, and I thought he was dead. So I like took stopped paying attention for a second, but he still had chip health, and then he... And Body him. Well, I mean, we both had chip health. I could have thrown a meter burn rocket right over him and, and killed him, but if I... I that's, uh, never give up. Hey, yeah, never. Power of will. So here we go. Yellow Lantern against... All right, so Tom gets knocked out, interactable. Goes for the other one, and then Jailhouse hits him out of it. Yeah. Tom has a life leader now. He still has to get in on GL because GL can outzone him. Yeah, GL has, has a tendency to get a little bit impatient, though. He should be just throwing air fireballs all day. Yeah, ending in that machine gun smart because you put Aquaman in that range where he can't hit you with normals. Yeah. And he has to respect your lift. Damn, he hits it with Turbine. Throws the flower at him. GL has a really big fan of Meter Burn Rocket. I actually it's don't much. Yeah. He builds a lot more meter than I do, it seems like. Right now he's doing a good job. Oh, that, that was a nice break. That would have killed him if he didn't do that. Really? Yeah, the chip on that is enormous. He would have meter burned and that would have killed him. Huh. Jail takes the first round. Yeah, getting a little bit too aggressive. Got to slow himself down. Yeah. Nice lift. Yeah, that's that was gonna a good hurt. Is ends with the turbine. Interesting. Pressure in the corner. Nice oh, block nice. by that's, Tom. That's actually plus on block. That meter burn yeah. rocket's like plus twenty, I think. Yeah. Oh, oh nice! That was nice. Meter burning that smart idea. Oh, knocks him out of the flower. Jailhouse in a bad way right now. And that's gonna do it. Nice chip though. That's actually a really good setup. Four two into that because they have to block the rocket standing. Yeah, this is bad. Yeah, this is, it's gonna be hard to make a comeback now. And Aquaman is a tank. Not seeing much uh, water shield. Not that it matters. Brady could have ended it right there. Nice uppercut. Doesn't That's matter. gonna take the match. Yep. yep. Jailhouse getting a little bit too aggressive. Needs to play lamer. See the thing about GL on wake up is he has a lift, which is a very good wake up. Yeah. But if you think your opponent's gonna lift, instead of just blocking, you could just walk up and do the bounce cancel, meter burn, yeah. and full combo punch him, which Tom just did. Mm -hmm. I I try and react when I see some I normally don't do it until I see them flinch. That also blows up wake up attacks like Killer Frost's slide. And other single hitting wake up attacks. Yeah. Killer 